Organization mm -hmm. Wrestling, and there is a stretch that Sweet Tan, the master of disaster, is putting on Dennis Gale. Takes him by the hair. He said, you know, Dennis Gale never gives up. He just continued to fight back. This is going to be a great match. Sweet Tan working on Dennis Gale's shoulder right now. Gale reverses it, gets him into the arm bar. He's got Bob Sweet Tan flat on the canvas. Referee Danny Barlow keeping a close watch on this. There's your reverse chicken wing. I'll tell you what, that puts the pressure on your elbow and your, sho and your uh, shoulder and your wrist area. And Dennis Gale is working on that arm. CJ, you know Dennis Gale has Dr. D, David Schultz. That happens at 87 at Mobile, Alabama on June 30. June 30. That's right now, fans. That's a Tuesday night. If you would like some ticket information, you can get in touch with the World Organization Wrestling Offices. Our phone number is area code 904-453-3806. Give us a call. Make your reservations early. Get in on the happening of 87. It's going to be the biggest wrestling card ever to come to Expo Hall in Mobile, Alabama. And you will see these two wrestlers in action. Sweet Dan just takes Gale and throws him off the uh, mat onto the concrete floor. And what is this? Oh, no. He brings him back in. Non-stop action on World Organization Wrestling. Bob Sweetan and Dennis Gale getting down and getting dirty. Danny Barlow, the referee, is trying to get Sweetan away from Gale and give him a little breathing room, let him get back into the ring. Sweetan takes Gale and puts him into the turnbuckle. And Sweetan, you know, he's oh, using every filthy, nasty, nasty, uh, Hold it. Oh, and a reverse on that. Sweet Dan goes into the turnbuckle. Gale is putting Dennis it on him now. Is fighting back. He never gets up. He never quit fighting back. This is a great match. Yeah. Bob Sweet Dan has his hands full. And, and I'll you know, tell you Sweet what. Sweet Dan is the master of disaster, the president of the bunk. He knew all the tactics. He gave it tactics, and he'll use them all to win. There's the pressure on Dennis Gale's chin, the side of his head. Dennis Gale is working on a move right now. And I'll tell you what. Gale with a chin lock. Bob Sweetan, speaking of the master of disaster, as Dennis Gale comes back. Oh, shots over the pit. Oh, I'll tell you what. Was that a move? And that was an experience. Look at SCJ, look at SCJ, Turbo Ted. Is helping, He's helping Dennis Gale. Oh, what a <laughs> shot! What a shot Gale put on Turbo Ted. And Bob Sweetan is taking Ted back to the dressing room. Oh, did you see that? He put Turbo Ted's head into the door. He's got Gale in there. Slam the door. What is going on here? What has happened? Referee Danny Barlow is going back. Can you hear that? In the, there's something going on back in the dressing room right now. Looks like yeah, the referee runs through the dressing room. I don't, I don't know who will emerge out of this. What is going on? Here comes the Coastal Connection. They're going to help Dennis Gale. He was taken back into the dressing room. Bob Sweetan took him back. There was all kinds of uh, noise. And now Dennis Gale have a turbo laceration on his forehead. So the I can't believe that. The master Look at that. Dennis Gale is losing blood right now. And we're going to have to take this break, ladies and gentlemen. We'll be right back after these messages. It's summer clearance time at Milton Dodge Chrysler Plymouth and your chance to buy a top quality used car at wholesale trade-in prices. 82 VW pickup for 99 down, 119 a month. An 84 Plymouth Colt Turbo, 99 down, 139 a month. An 86 Omni, 99 down and 139 a month. An 85 half-ton pickup for 99 down, 149 a month at Milton Dodge Chrysler Plymouth, Highway 90 in Milton, Florida. You'll like our deals and you'll like the way we treat you. 
fall into bosom buddies, the funniest show on television. May I see the wine list? Kip and Henry are two red-blooded all-American guys hiding out in a hotel for women. That cream doesn't work unless you rub it in all over. Well, this is vanishing cream, so I guess I better manage. And they're surrounded by the sexiest women you've ever seen. Good job, God. So catch the comedy with bosom buddies. Saturday nights at 10 on TV 44. Hi, wrestling fans. A great night of action coming to Crestview, Florida, June the 16th at Crestview High School. That's Crestview High School. Don't miss that on the 16th. Blindfold Battle Royal. The CC Connection will be on that card. Turbo Ted, Dennis Gale, newcomer, the British heavyweight champion, Gene Cooper. You want to you see that match. Also, coming to the Border Street Arena tomorrow night. Pensacola, Florida. You want to be there to see that. Another great night of action. Also, Chatham, Alabama on the 20th. Jackson, Alabama on the 29th. And with me on the podium, a gentleman I call Mobile, Alabama's favorite son, Bob Holly. Bob, you sure have come a long way, buddy. Thank you very much, Terry. You know, there's a lot of things going on in the world organization wrestling area. And tomorrow night in Pensacola, Florida, I have Pat Rose. Mr. Rose, we've met before, and you have yet to put me out you know I know the 30th is coming up and that's basically what's on my mind because uh, come the 30th the International Night of Champions I'm gonna take that belt from Bill Ash and Rose you're not gonna stop me because I'm gonna go through you and anybody I have to to make it June 30th International Night of Champions I want all my fans to come out and support me because I can use all the support I can get I'll tell you what you've done a super job so far Bob Holly Dennis Gale You've been a thorn in the side of Mr. Sweet Tan for a while now, and I'd like to know, and the fans like to know, why would you not become a member of the Bomb Squad? Well, I'm going to tell you something, Terry. I might be a thorn in his side, but I'm fixing to become a briar patch, and I'm going to wrap all around him. I'm my own man. Bob Sweet Tan, I don't want none of your deception, boy. I was on that side for a while. I saw there was a better way. I'm going to tell you something. You thought this was real cute, didn't you, Bob Sweet Tan? Well, it's not, buddy. And I'm going to tell you something. You did one good thing and one bad thing. You made me mad and mad good. You Ladies can feel the excitement. It is here, the Coastal Connection, Terry. The hottest thing on world organization wrestling, brother. Three young gentlemen that have taken the wrestling world by storm. You can hear their theme song playing, Girls, Girls, Girls. They will be taking on Turbo Ted and the Destroyer. Well, Pat, we know all about Turbo Ted. Yes, we do. Uh, that little incident that, that happened uh, a few minutes ago, I tried to get in that back dr uh, dressing find room. Find out what happened. And find out what the devil went wrong. Evidently, uh, Dennis Gale not only made Bob Sweetan mad, but he has made the whole entire bomb squad mad. Back into the action here, the Coastal Connection. Chuck Wilson, leapfrog. Oh, and a great drop kick on Turbo Ted. Another crooked over the Destroyer. And an arm drag by Chuck Wilson of the Coastal Connection. You know something? Turbo Ted's always in the wrong place at the wrong time. And he's yeah. You gotta hand it, I gotta hand it to Good move right there. Turbo Ted. He's tough as nails. Coastal Connection working very well. Great action here. Ted drop slam. Now a nice defensive move there. David Baxter. David Baxter had that arm bar. Uh, was holding on right. to it. Turbo Ted went for the slam. David Baxter just held on to that arm bar. Oh, yeah. Double shot to the side of Turbo Ted and Chuck Wilson. Back in that headlock and a takedown. Chuck Wilson applying the pressure on Turbo Ted. Tag is made, in comes David Baxter. Good move by Baxter. Took Ted to a one and a half count. Turbo Ted wants to make the tag, he can. David Baxter drags him, literally drags him back into the middle of the ring. Well, David Baxter. Yes, <laughs> he's fired up, ain't he? <laughs> Woo, Coastal Connection. Dropping those elbows onto the style. Turbo Ted putting the hurt on him. A tag made to Chuck Wilson. 
Turbo Ted wants out of there. Something fierce. Leg drop across the thigh. Turbo Ted crawling to the corner trying to get away. Working on the leg. Working on the leg of Turbo Ted. That baby should be about numb this time, uh, Terry. He's, he's got him in a leg bar with his own leg. Oh, Turbo Ted trying to punch his way out of this. Look at Chuck Wilson on him. Bringing him back. Goes into a, re a reverse headlock. Goes back over, ta tags David back for the goal. Yes. Making it to him. Non-stop action. World Organization Wrestling. Pro <laughs> Ted. He is trying to go. Oh, look at Ted. You can't it's take that you know, much away from Ted. He hangs right. in there. He's a competitor. Oh, look at that drop toe hold by David Baxter. Applying pressure to the shins and ankles of the destroyer. Destroyer. Gonna let trying to help, have the referee help him, but David Baxter pulls him out. He's gonna break it anyway, I believe. Stretching the thigh muscle of the destroyer. Good wrestling action here. Oh! Look at David Baxter putting the leg stretch on the destroyer. Pull your leg right out of the socket, won't you? Know, a young man like David Baxter yeah. is young and vigorous and in great position as he is. The reason he does wrestle so well is he came from a wrestling family. His father was one of the most famous professional wrestlers around. Here's your tag. Here comes Chuck Wilson. Another shot on that leg of the destroyer. Body splash across the leg of the destroyer. I'll tell you what, this uh, destroyer may need another leg when he leaves here today. Got that step over toe hold. Kicked off. Monkey flip. I have seen Chuck. Oh, right. Chuck Wilson right back up and into the leg hold again. Boy, they're putting, uh, putting the pressure on that leg. Another tag made. Chuck Wilson coming off that second rope and dropping an elbow across the leg. And Destroyer should be thinking about getting over and making a tag. He is. I think he's like trying it. to, but I believe his leg's too weak. Yeah. They've been working on that leg for a, they, a good they, couple minutes now. But it doesn't, CJ, they have not hurt that leg enough because he is still standing on it. Here. Look at this. Yes. Look at the Another stretch there. Another stretch. Oh, the doctor puts one on Parker. Turbo Ted. Oh, Destroyer got him off of that abdominal stretch. You CJ. can't take that anything away from the Destroyer. He is a good wrestler. Oh, and Wilson just throws Turbo Ted out of the ring. Body slams the Destroyer. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, see, look at this Coastal Connection. There's your winner. The Coastal Connection once again. Chuck Wilson, David Baxter, and Bobby Perez. The Coastal Connection. They're hot, brother. Super wrestling action on World Organization Wrestling. We will be back. We've got a special interview with Pat Rose. He'll be talking about the big happening in Mobile, Alabama on June 30th. Stay with us, wrestling fans. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I guess you've figured out by now that there's a historic night right around the corner. The International Night of Champions, The Happening 87, June 30th, Mobile, Alabama. Now, Eddie Sullivan, I hope you're listening to this interview because it's going to be directed to you. Let me enlighten you, as Rip Tyler says, a little bit about my attitude when I go down to Expo Hall in Mobile on the 30th of June. Now, when I bust through them doors walking down that aisle to that squared circle, I don't want these little punk kids coming and saying, Pat, can I have an autograph? Because I'll slap you down. That's the kind of attitude I'm coming with, Eddie Sullivan. Now, I want to thank my good friend, the master of disaster, Bob Sweetan, for letting me come out here just a few weeks ago and sign that little paper to give me the chance to wrestle for that beautiful belt. Now, when you win that beautiful belt, there's a lot of money and there's a lot of gold that'll be on this belly right here. Now, as for the money part, I'm gonna get together all my credit cards and I'm going shopping. And that's before June 30th because I know 
that Pat Rose is going to come out the new WOW Wrestling United States Heavyweight Champion. I bet that makes you sick, Eddie Sun, to see me out here saying I'm going to be the next champion. Look me dead in the eyes, Eddie Sullivan. You're nothing but a fat has-been. It's time for the Pat Roses, the Marcel Pringles, to get into the ring and take care of business. So when you come to Expo Hall, you come for a fight. Felix and Oscar are the odd couple. Darling, do you think it's the best idea in the world for you to watch Uncle Oscar eat? <laughs> what are you doing in New York, starting your own alimony collection agency? <laughs> when Sherman marched through Georgia, he left it neater than this. So what else we do? Next thing you do is you brush off the plate. Oh, I'd like that. Well, I knew you would. Yeah. The Odd Couple, weeknights at 10 on TV 44. The biggest and most incredible camper sale happens this Thursday through Sunday at Northwest Campers. Every RV, motorhome, fifth wheel, camper trailer, and all RV accessories are clearly marked down for this incredible sale. Save as never before on Holiday Rambler, Avion, Trail Seeker, and Sunline. Free coats and popcorn. Every RV will be clearly marked with rock bottom pricing. You can't afford to miss this incredible camper sale. Thursday through Sunday only at Northwest Campers, one and a half miles east of the zoo on Highway 98, Gulf Breeze, Florida. Wrestling fans, I'm C.J. Whitmore for World Organization Wrestling. We've got some great action coming up in Pensacola tomorrow night. The main match, the main title bout between Bob Sweetan and the current World Organization Wrestling television champion, Cowboy Dennis Gale. Great match there. Also, World Organization Wrestling coming to Crestview, Florida, June 16th at the high school there. A blindfold battle royal. Some great matches there in Crestview at the high school. Also, World Organization Wrestling in Chatham, Alabama on the 20th, and also in Jackson, Alabama on the 29th. Bob Sweetan, a big match against Cowboy Dennis Gale tomorrow night in Pensacola. You know something, I listen to this man get up here and spout off and shoot off his mouth. Well, let me tell you something, you Georgia cracker. I've listened to you and I've watched you for the last few weeks. You try to abuse this man. You figure, well, there's somebody smaller than yourself, you can take advantage of him. Well, it doesn't work that way. All you people sitting out there watching it right now, you just saw a little while ago what happened to Dennis Gale, the TV champion, when he steps in the ring with a man. You look a little bit different, Dennis Gale. Your face is a little bit altered. It doesn't quite look the same, does it? You want to know why? Because you can't take the pressure in the ring, Dennis Gale. You're walking around here with that TV tie and you're telling everybody, oh, what I'm thinking about is about June the 30th when I have to put it online against Dr. Death, David Schultz. Well, that's neither here nor there. What I'm talking about is tomorrow night, right here in Pensacola, Florida, Border Street Arena. When that bell rings and our match goes in the ring, Dennis Gale, there's only one thought now in my mind. And that thought is to hurt you, to cripple you, and to abuse you, and stop you right in the match. And while I'm doing that, why not? I may as well add another title to my stack. I may as well get that TV title, and then you can walk around here crying the blues to everybody begging for forgiveness and getting another chance to get in the bomb squad. Hey, Dennis Gale, you're out and you're done for and it's all over with. Okay, here we go. Our next match on World Organization Wrestling Carry. Here he comes, the marvelous one from Mobile, Alabama, Marcel Pringle. And not only that, CJ, we've got another gentleman from Mobile, Alabama, Mobile, Alabama's favorite son. I'm talking about none other than Bob Holly, the gentleman who will wrestle Professor Bill Ash for the light heavyweight title of the world at the happening of 87, the International Night of Champions. Two Mobile gentlemen. You know, uh, Marvelous Marcel wanted to say hello to Grandma Pringle on, over in downtown Dog River, wherever that's at. I think that must be the Beach Clover Club. Yeah. That? <laughs> but, uh, he wanted us to mention that. He, he wants to say hello to Grandma Pringle in downtown Dog River. We got some mobile, oh, great arm sling by Bob Holly. It's going to be some competition here. Two mobile uh, boys that uh, are really uh, being for the title. Who's mobile's favorite son? That's right. And uh, marvelous Marcel Pringle is going to have to go, son, to get that title away from Bob Holly. And I'll tell you what, Bob Holly was putting a hurting on uh, Marcel Pringle, but. 
the tables have turned right now. We got the arm bar. Well, they, they're going after it hot and heavy. I'll tell you what. There's a lot of pride involved in this wrestling match. Yes, there is. A lot of pride. A lot of city pride here. Oh, oh yes. Look at that. Back Look at that. Two count. Mar hey, marvelous Marcel Pringle. Hey, bridged up. Brother, you can't take anything away from Marcel Pringle. He Look is a that. great wrestler. Look at this. Oh, right, right into a slam. Whoa, arm arm drag by Bob Holly. Danny Barlow is asking him, are you giving up? Bob How you doing? And Marcel Pringle, both. Pringle will not give up. I think these boys are not going to give up. Uh-uh, this is a matter of pride, this match. This ain't a matter of money. This ain't a matter of anything. But, carry one of my but pride. I don't know, CJ. I know one thing. Bob Holly is a, one of the most accomplished wrestlers I've ever seen. And a great a athlete. Time. A great athlete. And marvelous Marcel Pringle is equally as good. Marvelous Marcel Pringle has won a many a match. Experienced Marcel Pringle, of course, was teamed up with Dennis Gale and a tag team Look at that. doing his Drop own. Toe hold by Bob Holly. Good wrestling moves here. I tell you what, I've seen more, more great wrestling moves today on this uh, television than, than I have seen in the past eight or ten years anywhere. These gentlemen have, have, have really accomplished uh, Coming scientific wrestlers. Gary, you've been in there. Do you ever wish you were back? Oh, I've wished I was back in that ring a hundred million times, CJ. And every now and then I sit back, fantasize I will, but I can't. <laughs> it's one thing. Look at that leapfrog. Great. Oh, Another arm drag by Bob Holly. Super action on World Organization Wrestling. You will see that week after week after week. Pringle's got it. Holly hanging on to that arm you. bar, applying the pressure to the elbow and shoulder. And now he's dropping a knee right into the back of the arm of Marcel Pringle. And Marcel Pringle using the hair as leverage. Whips off Holly. Tackle. Pringle drops down. One cut. Up. Whoa! Look at Bob Holly! Look at that! Oh, and Bob Holly got there. Oh, and he missed oh, that one. He missed it. Pringle saw it coming. Oh, Pringle missed one. Great action. And another hard drag by Holly. Look at Holly hanging on to that arm. What a wrestler. If he wrestles like this, the International Night of Champions, he may be. Professor Bill Ash will have his hands full, won't he? Not only will he have his hands full, he may be an ex-champion when Holly gets giving up that him. belt there. That's for Bob sure. Holly hanging on there. You wrestling fans in Mobile. Marcel Pringle. Get there to the happening of 87 and cheer Bob Holly on because this is his big break. He is excited about this oh, match. Yes, sir. Well, hey, it's marvelous Marcel Pringle's big break, too. Well, that's right. He's going to wrestle that's the right. international Japanese heavyweight champion. That's Mr. right. Rico. That's right. If he wins that strap, he can go to, to, to Japan and be a millionaire in a week. <laughs> I mean, that's... If, uh, You're if, right. If Pop Holly right. wins this title, he can do You're the right. same thing here in the United States plus overseas. That's right. I'll tell you. Bob Holly has hardly even broken a sweat here, Terry. I know. The man's an unreal know he don't smoke, he don't drink. He just works out and, and eats, drinks, and sleeps wrestling. Look at that flying body press off the second turnbuckle. Take oh. Pringle to a two count. What do we have here? Oh, oh that move too fast. Yes. What a great match here, Terry. Tell you what. I tell you what, I hate that this, this match is going to end going off the air. This is DJ, a 20 minute time limit. But man, what a match. Okay, we're going to have to leave this action here momentarily, Terry. While uh, we're uh, in wrestling, we've got a couple of commercial breaks, and we will be right back, wrestling fans, with more World Organization Wrestling. Here at Milton Dodge Chrysler Premise, we have a huge selection of top-quality used cars offered right now at wholesale trade-in prices. 
1978 New Yorker Brougham loaded low mileage car for 1988. An 84 Plymouth Horizon for 39.88. An 84 Jeep CJ7 for 49.88. And an 86 Plymouth Reliant for 59.88 at Milton Dodge Chrysler Plymouth. Highway 90 in Milton, Florida. We have a huge selection to choose from. You'll like our deals and you'll like the way we treat you. The battle for supremacy in the National League West continues Tuesday night at 7.30 on TV 44. As the Cincinnati Reds face the division champs, the Houston Astros, WJTC TV 44 will bring you live coverage of what promises to be an exciting matchup. So don't miss the first pitch. Tuesday night at 7.30, following sports pros and cons, right here on WJTC TV 44. Here comes another shot right across the shoulders. He's numbing him up a little bit. What a match this has been, CJ. Got him on the wrestling. There's Pringle resorting to the, the tactics that he's using sometimes. And you can hear the shots coming off the uh, shoulders of Bob Holly. Here comes Pringle. Shot into the ropes. Holly jumps and strikes him in the face. I thought he had him then, brother. High drop kick. You realize marvelous Marcel Pringle is about six foot, six foot one, and Holly drop kicked him right in the face. Oh, into the turnbuckle. Hard shot, hard shot. Tell you what, oh, back drop to Holly now. Looks like Pringle is, is getting in there, getting the best of him. I'm going to tell you one thing, C.J., is the happening of 87, the International Night of Champions. Mr. Ito and Bill Ash are going to wrestle two of the best they've ever wrestled at any time. We want to remind you wrestling fans, if you do need ticket information, you can call 453-3806, area code 904. Matches this been today, CJ. I'll tell you what, we've had some great wrestling action on World Organization Wrestling. And fans, we're out of time right now. And I'm sorry that we can't take this to the conclusion. But coming up on next week's show, be with us lady wrestlers in action, Angie Minnelli versus Melinda Smith. They will be going head to head, if you will, in an elimination match to determine who will get their shot at the World Championship match with Ann Casey in Mobile at the happening of 87. That's right. Next week, Ann Casey's going to be here for an interview with us. So we'll see you again next week. Come back. World Organization Wrestling. Tales on the health benefits Contour Chairs provides. Call me to get this important free information by mail now. To order, call toll-free 1-800-441-2929, 1-800-441-2929. Call 1-800-441-2929, toll-free 1-800-441-2929. Wrestling fans, at this time, we have Bob Holly on the podium. Of course, you took that match to Bill Ash in the happening of 87, and you've got the belt, Junior Heavyweight Championship, and we congratulate you, Bob. I thank you, CJ. You know, i got a few things I need to get off my mind. First of all, I want to thank all those people who came out, supported me uh, last night, the Interni International Night of Champions. I want to thank all of you fans. You know, there's another thing. World Organization Wrestling, you fans didn't realize, but I did, that World Organization Wrestling is doing away with the junior heavyweight class. And what I'm going to do is they're going to put this belt up, so I'm setting this belt aside. But I am happy about one thing. I'm happy that I won and I earned this belt. I did it all on my own. And with all you fans out there, I had something to prove to you fans and to me also. And I just want to say that I'm turning in this belt and also I'm happy about I will be the last person in the United States to have my name engraved on a plate with this belt because I'm the last one to carry this belt. You know, I want to thank all the fans out there for their support. I really appreciate it. And I request this match with Mr. Ito, who is now in the ring, to prove to you people that I can keep up with the big boys. And I'm going to show you that I'm not a pushover. Okay, we congratulate you, Bob Holly. We got the match. Here we go in the ring. Bob Holly against Mr. Ito. 
Well, CJ, my, my favorite man there, Bob Holly, took the title away from Bill Ash and proved that he was caliber of wrestler we at the World Organization Wrestling always thought he was. A most capable young athlete, and he proved it by, by beating uh, an old veteran like Professor Bill Ash. And I, I was there, watched the match, and boy, what a wrestling match. It sure was, I tell you. And no one is more deserving than Bob Holly. Bob Holly's in there with a, an old scrapper that'll, that'll beat you in a heartbeat. And that's Mr. Ito, the Japanese international heavyweight.